good morning students in the last video we are done some problems in this video we are going to do some more problems okay the first question is <coughs> question number one there are two families a and b in family a there are four men six women two children and in family b there are two men two women and four children the recommended daily amount of calories is 2400 for men 900 for women 1800 for children and 45 gram of protein for men 55 gram grams for women and 33 grams for children represent the above information using matrices by matrix multiplication Calculate the total requirement of calories and proteins for each of two of the two families. Okay, first students, the pause the video to write it down the question. Okay, now the answer. Students, there are two data given. <coughs> first one is. There are two families, family A and family B. Let it be in row wise. Okay. In row wise, family A and family B. And common column wise, man, woman, and children. Okay. Now, <coughs> the given data is in family A, there are four men, six women, two children. In family B, there are two men, two women, four children. Okay. If we write in matrix, then it will be two by three matrix. Let it be P. Okay. Now, the second data is <clears throat> if you take man, woman, and children in row wise and the calorie and protein in column wise then the data will be 2400 calorie for man and uh, 55 i think 45 45 protein for man 1900 calorie for woman and uh, 55 protein for woman now 1800 calorie for children and uh, 33 protein for children it will be 3 by 2 matrix now listen students why we take the first matrix is 2 by 3 and second matrix suppose it will be q in 3 by 2 matrix okay because the <coughs> in first matrix the column is man woman and children in second matrix the row is man woman and children and we know that if we multiply two matrices then the first matrix matrix number of column equal to in second matrix number of row that's why we take in first matrix man woman and children as three and in second matrix man women and children in row wise okay now the question is how to solve these two matrices or given data by using matrix multiplication method okay so listen <coughs> first the given information can be written in matrix form okay it is p there is q okay p is in the form of 2 by 3 matrix and q is 3 by 2 matrix okay now the total requirement of calories and proteins we have to require the families family a and family b is required calories and proteins okay now the answer will be 2 by 2 because in first matrix the families are in row wise that's why it is 2 okay in second matrix the calories and proteins in column wise that's why it is 2 
if we multiply this two matrix that is p q okay is equal to 4 6 2 2 2 4 matrix is 2 by 3 matrix okay is multiple with 1445 is 955 1833 is 3 by 2 matrix is the number of column equal to number of row that's why we can easily multiply these two matrices and we know that how to multiply two matrices okay if we multiply these two matrices then we get the answer is 224,600 okay here it is 576 it's 15,800 it's 332 matrices okay now the number of row means first matrices row okay that is family okay let's so say this first family a family and b family and column column means second matrices column that is calorie and protein that's why it is calorie and this one is protein the first family calorie is 24600 and protein is 576 now second family is or second um, family b is <coughs> for calorie 15800 and protein 333 this is the answer okay pause the video to write it down now the second question okay the question is a trust fund has 50000 rupees that is to be invested in two types of bonds the first and second bonds respectively pay annual interest at a rate of 5% and 6% respectively using matrix multiplication determine how to invest the money in these bonds so as to get a total annual interest of 2780 rupees okay now the answer is <coughs> let the investment in first bond sorry font suppose X okay then in second font That will be must be fifty thousand minus x because the total amount of invest is fifty thousand. Nah? That's why the in if the first investment is x, then obviously the second phone investment must be fifty thousand minus x. Okay. Now, if we write this one in matrix form, then it will be suppose matrix A equal to okay this one is x this one is 50,000 minus x this is investment okay in first phone this one is for second phone first one okay it is a 1 by 2 matrix now second thing is <coughs> given that the annual interest at a rate of 5% and 6% for these two funds okay as you take first phone and second phone in column wise in first matrices so obviously in second matrices second matrix it will be in row wise so it is, this one is first and second phone okay and this one is five percent six percent okay this equal to this equal to uh, five by hundred it's six by hundred okay now the answer question is <clears throat> by using matrix multiplication determine how to invest how to invest the money 
in this bonds okay so as to get a total annual interest of 2780 right that's why must be the answer is ab so here ab equal to 2780 right now ab ab means friends this one first matrix so x 50000 minus x okay a matrix is multiple with this one so 5 by 100 6 by 100 okay if we multiply this two matrix then we get it's actually 1 by 2 matrix is 2 by 1 matrix so answer will be x into this one so 5x by 100 Plus six. This one, okay. Fifty thousand minus x into six by hundred matrix. Okay. This one equal to AB matrix means two thousand seven eighty. Two thousand seven eighty, right? If we solve this one, we get. So this one, okay, this will be thirty thousand. I think this one minus x by hundred. This one is two seven eighty. Just solve this, and we get the answer. And answer, students, answer is. Uh, in first form, okay. In first form, the answer is twenty-two thousand. Okay. In second form, in second form means what? This one is x students. X. In second form, fifty thousand minus x. So fifty thousand minus twenty-two thousand. It will be twenty-eight thousand. In second one, okay. It will be twenty-eight thousand. This is the answer. Okay, write it down. If you have any doubt, then write on the comment box. Thank you. Yeah.